Man, I don't want to play this game. Crazy. I've never made this far before. This is a new... new uh... Alright, uh... Oh, look at that, Achievo. You got a, you get achievements for these games? Yeah, now? this is just a regular game. It's a regular game. Yeah, it's not an X no, game. No, it's just a regular game. You bought it from the store? Yeah. Really? So somebody at Microsoft had to have signed off on this. <laughs> somebody lost their job. I hope so. Well, have you seen all the really crappy games on the Wii U marketplace? There's some really there's bad some, ones on there. There's some like. Whoa. I call them like oh. streamer bait games or like YouTube bait, like PewDiePie or Markiplier. Like they make them deliberately bad and memey, so they'll so we'll get some streamer to play them and then have a bunch of kids that want to buy it. For, yeah, that makes sense for shitty forced sense of humor type of things. Like uh, was it called uh, something uh, something haunted mansion of jump scares? Who's Haunted Mansion of Jump Scares, which it's just an entire randomly generated mansion where there's nothing but jump scares. Nice. Throughout the entire game, I was like, wouldn't it? Wouldn't the effect wear off? Pretty you would think. I need ten keys now. Anyway, um, yeah, I've seen some of them. Like, there's one, the one called the Letter, which is one of the first truly bad ones. But there's some great ones too, like. I would say the Wii U has a very extensive library of titles, like from Wii Regular, and 64, Super Nintendo Mania, so like there, there's some good shit out there, but I guess I don't pay too much attention to Wii shopping. Yeah. Alright, so, final verdict. Do you want to play this? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> then that's, and that's why it's on. That's the name of the game. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's not like the worst game I've ever played. It's just like there's nothing. It feels special. like a purgatory, like an endless loop of the same corridors, and just like the only thing to get excited for is the new enemy, <laughs> the one new enemy <laughs> per right. level. Just eat the same meals, collecting the same gold. Just another asshole trying to ruin your day. Yeah, like, yeah, what do you think it's going to be next time? What's the boss going to be? i got to find out. Yeah. I wonder how many levels there are. If this is a fully-fledged game, and it was on the Xbox Marketplace, I would say this guy probably stretched it out to 50 levels. 50? 50 levels. 50. It was, it was like $5. 50 levels. Oh, my God. Well... I'm gonna be at some. Did you read the description before you purchased the game? No, I just looked at the screenshot. Oh, like yeah, this, that looks like, this looks really quali bad. Quality game. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, this looks like the worst game ever. I need to. Play. Yeah. I was just morbid curiosity. There was no video clips of it. Like no one had played it. And uh, until now. <laughs> so I had to see what it was all about. Okay, now I have to find the end to the level. Do you ever feel bad, like if you're ripping on a game like this, and it's so like there's no YouTube footage? You know the creator's going to find it and watch it. I'll be like, yeah, I fucking scammed you. I got you. <laughs> but a nice burger off of the, your purchase. Right. Now I'm getting all the exposure for free. Ha ha. Ha ha. Do you think that's how they feel if I put out a video and seven people watch it? I mean, this is the most least effort game I've ever seen in my life. So, yeah. <laughs> like design wise? Yeah. It's like the. Adventure mode from Tobal One. Is that the boss? Oh my! Is he, is he, is he sliding on the ground? <laughs> Mr. Butter Shoes skating over there. Poke. Why are you poking him with your the tip there? Just the tip. Yeah. Is that a spear? Is that it's what a halberd? Okay, so it is a spear. <laughs> Do the weapons have different strength? I guess so. Attack, I don't. I truly don't know. Five enemies killed. Well, I didn't get very much experience for that. Okay, I know they're gonna change it up in this next one. <laughs> this time. Yeah, get. I can't buy anything else. So I didn't pick uh, anything else up. So. See, I you, if you have to fight to open the chests, yeah. or else they'll attack you while you're opening the chest. But if you just run through, you don't need anything. Was Cortana named after the Halo? Yes. One? Is it the same voice actress? Is yes. it voice actress? I don't know if it's the same voice actress, but it sounds the same. Oh. That's funny. What is, look at these shadows. What is this? 
Are there bad guys here? I want to know. I had to whisper it because it's right. always listening. It is always listening. What do we got? Oh, we got Skelly guys. Hey, they were in the screenshot. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Gotta be getting closer to that Serpent King. Oh my god. I need to pick up this. Okay. Episode 70. Uh, <laughs> Crypt of the Serpent King. This time I can feel it. I'm getting close. <laughs> gotta pick up this gold. Yeah, you gotta get the gold at least. The gold's giving me you're almost getting, a thousand. Yeah, you're getting a ton of gold now, so you could probably che check out that uh, bow or crossbow. Yeah. Ooh, extra health. This. I this. bet the bow mechanics work so much better than Fragile Dreams. I, I didn't watch that one. video yet. It's a long one, I know. But I had a lot to say. <laughs> like, I was. It's one of those situations wherever you can see a game that could be phenomenal. And it, it could be like one of the best games you've ever played, but it falls short at every turn. Yeah. And I don't know. I was frustrated all throughout. And it was one of those things that I had a few friends recommend me that game. They're like, oh. Most underrated Wii game. You got you got to check it out. So good. The story's so sad. It's not. It's not nothing. <laughs> nothing's earned. It's really short. The controls are some of the worst I've ever experienced on a game wow. of that caliber. I guess it's pretty bad. I mean, yeah. I I kind of go into greater detail there, but the reason why is like you know. Whenever I criticize the game, there's a lot more to say when you dislike a game and you can't right. go into it. If it's a good game, you're like, yeah, it's yeah, fun. Yeah, it's, it's great. <laughs> no, when, yeah. when I dislike it, I feel like I'm, like, killing someone's sacred cow. Like, so you have that, to explain yourself. Yeah, really? because there's there's people out there, like Fragile Dreams. I know there's, like, a, a cult audience, and that's their favorite game. And that was really? even reflected in the comments of that video. Like, oh, that's it's the best game ever. I was like, you didn't watch the video, did you? <laughs> like... They just came in and they were just like, "Oh, this is great, great game." <laughs> You're like, "Yeah, yeah clearly I agreed they, with you." <laughs> <laughs> that's that my thoughts exactly. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's not it's not the worst game I've ever played, but it's just like so middling. Like it, it could have been. Yeah. It has like those moments of brilliance where you're like, "Oh, it's going so no." What is the worst game you've ever played at this point? Uh, for all the bad games, Fugitive Hunter on the PS2. Really? It's just easily a worse game? Uh, yeah, it's one of the games that I felt like vomiting after playing it. Oh. I was hanging out with Mark. Okay, so it was, uh, we decided to play it the day that Barack Obama announced that SEAL Team 6 uh, assassinated uh, Osama bin Laden. Uh -huh. I was like, oh, we got him. We got to play Fugitive Hunter. It was something I picked up at a Goodwill. And the big draw fugitive hunters that came out in like 2003 or or so like yeah. early 2000s ps2 game and at the very end of the game you kill osama bin laden you have nice. this like crazy mortal Kombat fist fight with him okay. and i wanted to get to that part but along the way like you start off and you're just fighting a bunch of drug dealers in the darkest city of all time. It reminded me of that Robocop game that we played oh, on Thanks. Xbox. Anything that reminds you of that, you know is going to be a good time. <laughs> so it was like that but much worse. They didn't have the novelty of Robocop being in it. So uh, yeah, I just, I got a headache and I got sick just because everything, the frame rate wasn't consistent. All the, It was just like one rep beat that looped every <laughs> seven seconds. So I just started getting sick, like Action 52 sick. Like, oh, <laughs> remember God. that? Yes. Yeah, so it was like this? that. Is this the Beetle thing from the... Oh, no. So I thought it was a, one of the Beetle things what? from... Uh, it's like a... Galligator guy. The music's getting good. I thought it was from uh, Dark Crystal. Yeah. Poke. Oh. Poke. Oh, I'm slowing oh, down. Oh, no! Okay, that's fine. You got him. You got all that gold. Crossbow time. All right, no, I can't. It's like fifteen thousand. Get get a projectile. <laughs> the cheapest is ten thousand. Oh. Hundred damage. How much does your halberd do? 
75. 80 is the highest in there. The highest is the sword? Yeah. I can get the Morningstar or Dude, Flail. Would you rather get hit by a sword or a Morningstar? <laughs> get that. I'd rather get hit by a sword. Really? Morningstar would hurt. <laughs> yeah, a sword you could just die. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, sweet release. The Morningstar would break all my bones and cause or me to Yeah, the flail, bleed. I guess. Oh my but yeah, yeah, this is this game. If you if you have enough speed, it goes fast enough where it's actually not that bad. Yeah, I was gonna say crank crank it. Ah! Up. Whoa! <laughs> actually, what? Oh. Oh. Oh no. I'm done this, in is, ring. this is where it's gonna go downhill. So, how did these guys get in the dungeon? Like, they put the regular people below the skeletons and monsters and stuff? Did you start at the top of the dungeon, and are you descending, or are you ascending? Oh, I see what you mean. Like, I don't know, because, uh... Well, I'm going down, like, at the end of each one, I'm going... Okay, so you're going down, so you started at the top, so. Yeah. I don't know. And the deeper I go, the people, the people are the, they are? The people should have been at the first level, yeah. and then monsters become more grotesque. It feels like you're gonna fight like a black knight at the end of this level. Yeah, That's my so. prediction. Black knight. Well, I don't know if we'll ever know because I want to download Soda Drinker Pro. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Alright, so, final verdict part two. What do you think? I haven't seen the bow and arrow, so I can't give a final verdict. <laughs> Gotta see how the projectiles work. Uh, there's 12 keys oh, on okay. this level. Okay, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> so yeah, that's that game. Who is it made by... Um, I don't know. <laughs> I wanted to call it. I thought it was Crypt of the Snake King. Is that the Snake King over there? Is Maybe. that where you're gonna fight? Because <laughs> the skeleton did show up, so I assume the thing on the left is the Serpent King. Yeah, I bet it's just slow because I'm streaming. Okay. Uh, let's go to the game hub. Two people are saying about this game. Oh God. Uh, nothing. Nothing. <laughs> what you should do is like when you post your video, you should say, "Hey, check out my review." <sighs> There's just. Yeah. Does it show you the rarity of your achievements? Yeah. Well, it's no. like how many people that own this game have the. Yeah, it does. Twenty nine percent of this, thirty five percent. So, of it's of the people who have played the yeah, game. Yeah, of the people who have played it, I guess they've made it that far. Of but, the people who have played it. But, how many of it's pretty high completed. percentages except for there's hard. seven levels oh on hard no oh, there's seven just, levels there's just seven levels let's finish it are you serious <laughs> let's do it we're <laughs> we're so invested in it now we'll be the only full playthrough of it we're on level five level five we might as well stick it out stick it out for that <laughs> okay i honestly thought it would be 50 levels but this is a giant ripoff then <laughs> I was understating how much of a ripoff for five bucks that reminds me did you uh ah. ever pick up that Disney afternoon collection no I didn't I was hoping they'd come out with a physical copy I think they are for 3ds and I really love a physical copy of that because I love all those games except for tailspin yeah Tailspin. I know they're making a, a follow up to it too, and I hope they do more like uh, Little Nemo, Little Mermaid. Little well, Nemo wasn't uh, Disney though. Oh, it wasn't. It was some weird anime thing. Okay, so then what have they got to work with? They've got Mickey Mouse capades. Yeah. They've got Little Mermaid. Maybe they can move up to Super Nintendo. That goof yeah. troop. Hell yeah. Or Genesis. Yeah, Genesis had some good ones. Uh, the Tailspin game on Genesis is fun. I like the Aladdin game on Genesis. Oh, yeah. I like the Genesis one more. I mean, they're both good, but I just... I had the Genesis one when I was a kid. Or I didn't have it, but I, I played it. I like them both. I think they're, they're they different both stand enough. on yeah. their own. I think the animation is leaps and bounds better on the Genesis, but uh, I think the music's better on the Super Nintendo one. Mm -hmm. As is the case most of the time. Like graphics and gameplay ah. are faster and better on Sega, but music is usually better on Super. Mm -hmm. Gotta get that gold. Oh my god, so much gold for gold. 
Yeah, I'd love a Goof Troop remaster. <laughs> I never played it. You're wearing the Goof Troop or the Goofy movie shirt, so I'm thinking Goofy. <laughs> yeah. yeah uh, uh, Jared and I, Jared had. Uh, I need the gold. I was over at his Thank house you. and we recorded ourselves playing uh, Goof Troop for the Pizza Pups hashtag All Stars. That's our uh, that's our Let's Play name. Pizza really? Pups hashtag All Stars. Nice. <laughs> what does that mean? What it means? It's very surface level. We don't have any deeper meanings. Okay. What you see is what you get. What Wizzy Wag? Wild Wiz Wag Wizzy Woodle Why is this taking so long to find a place I haven't been? Well, you got it. They expanded out the dungeons. I wonder if you get it like fast enough if you'll be going quake speeds. <laughs> I have to kill more guys like, though to get quake more experience. Arena. Or Unreal. That's what I'm talking about. Unreal. Well, I should start killing some dudes then to get more. Exp oh. Yeah, just one at a time. Ugh. Oh my god. Never mind. It's not worth it. Yeah, you get, there's some gold too. I bet I bet you can win this game if you get the projectiles though. You got three of them, you die. <laughs> nah man. It's not happening there. Can I lure them into the lava? Oh they're smart kinda. Whoa, whoa, what was that behind you? It's just music, I think. Okay. Can you cheese them? You can cheese them. <laughs> Did you get the experience for that? I no. Oh, okay, well maybe he's just alive down there. Oh god. I don't think that's supposed to happen. You can bait him. Whoa. Whoa. Wh what happened? Where'd the other one go? The third one? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. He's down there. Okay. Well. Anyway, <laughs> just gonna carry on. Is it every hundred experience points? Yeah. So just okay. Always the same. It's always the same. Super lazy. Yeah. It doesn't. Ex it doesn't go up. <laughs> Did you ever beat that game Blue Dragon on the 360? No, I never even played it. You never did. No. It has the I best the boss, boss theme of all time. But yeah, it's it's great. I'm thinking about picking it up and playing again. I bought it. Uh, it was on that sale where all the games were like two dollars. Yeah. So I have it on Xbox 360 or backwards compatible. It plays a lot like uh, Okage Shadow King. I've never played that either. That's I played crazy. a demo of uh, Blue Dragon back in the day, and that's it. All right, where's this last key? Maybe. Oh, or left. top left. Or yeah, it could be up there too. Yeah. Swing around up here. See if it's up here. These guys just start running from like a mile away. <laughs> they can't catch up with your mock speeds. I hmm. should have thought about that before they decided to kill me. What I would do is kill that guard and get all the treasure and shit. Just loot that hallway because there was a lot of chests. Oh, I heard yeah. that guy. Divide and conquer. Oh, uh, you're gonna level up too. Ooh, yeah. So, I'm getting into it now that I know it's seven levels. <laughs> you can see the. I can tolerate can the seven ends. levels. Yeah, like if it was one of those situations, just like kept going on thousand like levels. where Jigsaw has you in a room and he's like, "I want to play a game. You need to beat this game in 24 hours." You'd be like, "Okay." Yeah, I could do that. I'd crank up the speed for sure. Yeah, that seems like the way to go. Crank up the speed, maybe get the projectile. Oh, what? How much is it for the crossbow? Fifteen hundred. Uh, the crossbow is ten thousand, and the bow is eighteen thousand. Which one's stronger? The bow. I'd get the bow because you're almost at the last level. So. That's all the keys. Yeah, what you need to do is go through and loot and just get enough for the bow because you've only got two more levels. Hmm. You're getting close. I am. So, based on the achievements, like 10% of the people who played this game beat it on all three difficulties. Yeah? Well, I mean, I bet you could do it in an afternoon. Just do it three, play through it three times. Yeah. Or maybe if you play through it hard, you get the Chivos for normal and easy. Yeah, maybe there's a carryover. What if projectiles suck and I use up all my money on them? You could do that in uh, 
some other games on the 360. I think it was like Gears of War was one of the ones I remember. Beat it yeah. on Insanity with Brendan back in the day. Mm -hmm. I mean, most games would let you do it that way, but some games wouldn't. You, know, you have to beat it three times to get it all. Like Deadly Premonition. Yeah, except on the PS3 version, which uh, has the easiest platinum I've ever gotten. Really? Yeah, there's only one difficulty mode. It's defaulted on easy, and uh, nice. all you have to do is like do all the side missions. And after you get the radio in, Deadly Premonition, the side missions go by quickly. I can't find any more chests. I'm just going to finish the level. Wait, there's one. And it's gold. I don't have enough still. Wait! No. I'm gonna fight the bad guy and I'll just be short and I'll have to just buy either the regular bow or buy a new melee weapon and just save up. Why would you want a new melee weapon? This one's so great. <laughs> All the melee weapons are the same. Hey, wait, go kill one more guard because. It, the, this guy gives you a ton of experience. Okay. Uh, Black Knight! You're pretty. Black spot Knight? On. Did I get it right or what? Oh, he's like a skeleton. No, he's not. He's just a guy with a mask. He's a black knight. Well, I guess it's gold, but... I knew it was going to be a knight. Wow. <laughs> We're going to see the end of this game. I want to I wanna know what the Serpent King looks like. They've been hyping him up in the title. <laughs> 